gonna come. We're gonna find out. It's a cold three. We're gonna find out. I'm keeping an eye on y'all. Make sure sure y'all don't violate people's rights. You better stop yelling. I'm allowed to yell. It's my first amendment. Your buddy, they got you. Oh, I'm not yelling. I ain't struggling. Instructing is as physical. You know that? Just letting you know, it's physical. <laughs> Yo, back away from me, man. I'm not instructing you, bro. I'm not instructing you, yo. It's, it's physical. It's physical, dude. It's physical. Dude, it's physical. You can't arrest me. You can't arrest me. Power cruisers. Well, do you live in the city? I don't answer questions. You, you don't live in the city, so if, it's right, if you don't live in the city, it's not your cruiser, right? You know? Pay taxes in the city. You pay taxes in the city, so you live here? Sure do. I bought a stick of gum on my way down here. Oh, boy. Yeah, he's one of those. That's right, Erie County fam. Justin Starvaggy is back at it again. He's making up charges, false arrest, and being a tyrant. That's what this video is about. He's back in the news. Listen, y'all. These kids want to act up in school, want to go to school and embarrass you, want to make like they got no home training. So I told my son, don't go to school and no more. I take care of you, son. I give you anything you want. I discipline you. But you're going to bash me like this? No, so now I'm going to cut his hair. Oh, I got to ask you. Hey. Ball hair. Now I saw you were in a restricted area. Now I want your identification. You're not getting it. Don't embarrass me. I told you, don't embarrass me. No. All right, Erie County fam. So the new channel we are highlighting today is Javier is News. Um, Javier lives in Erie, Pennsylvania with the tyrants that are highlighted in this video, specifically Justin himself, the tyrant of all tyrants that I've met there. He's the one who makes an arrest of Javier just for speaking in public. What do you guys think about that? Oh. My dad. Yo, Evie police. Evie police down here again. See what's going on. We're bringing all the news. Anything that Evie police do we on them. We are going to investigate. You see the cops out here? Back up. Go on right there. Back up. Back up. Here they come. Look, light signs. Here they go. Here they come. Here they come. We're gonna find out. It's a code three. We're gonna find out. They're coming in hot. Make sure sure y'all don't violate people's rights. You better stop yelling. I'm allowed to yell. It's my first amendment. Free to speech. <laughs> Here 
Don't even have a warrant to be in there. I'm not yelling. No, I'm not. Stay back, Bunny. Stay back. Go get him in the car. We'll see what he's doing in that car. He fell over there. He busted his ass. <laughs> he over there. Doing some funny stuff over there.
Don't know that. No, we gotta finish. Yeah, get him over there. Look, he doing some funny shit. Over. Get him over there, Nate Bundy. I'm washing out for right here. Come right here. You know, you know, I was just talking to EDR. I was just talking to your buddy that got you. Oh, I'm not yelling. I ain't struggling. Instructing is as as physical. You know that? Just letting you know, it's physical. <laughs> Yo, back away from me, man. I'm not instructing you, bro. I'm not instructing you, yo. It's, it's physical. It's physical, dude. It's you physical. Keep out dude, to it's me. physical. You can't you arrest keep, me. You, you can't arrest me, dude. That's, that's my nation. You dude, keep I'm yelling out to me. I'm not yelling at you. You are. I'm not, dude. I'm not. Get your hand out your back. Come on, man. I told you to stop yelling, yelling at you several times. Time. My son might there, you're, man. My son might. You're taking I'm my... I'm not, I'm not taking, are. dude. Dude, try to make it easy, yeah, man. I'm not taking the station. I'm not taking the station, man. You are. Come on, man. I'm not yelling. I wasn't yelling, man. You know that. You are. I wasn't yelling, man. You keep taking my... Can I call my sister to come pick up my kids, man? I told you. How many times? Come on. I just... That's right, Erie County fam. What you just seen was Justin Starvaggy badge 456. Just arrest this man for speaking from across the street and he charged him with obstruction and we all know that obstruction has to be a physical force and that is clear by case law all over this country including United States Supreme Court case law. Oh but wait Erie County fam it gets dirtier than that coming from Justin Starvaggy of the Erie PA Police Department. If we look at here he is charged with section 5101 of title 18 of the Pennsylvania law. Now let's take a look at that and then we'll also notice what they have written on the lower half here of the definition. So as we pull up the law of the Pennsylvania title 18 chapter 51 of obstruction charges, let's go ahead and take a look here. As you see here, Javier was charged with 5101, obstruction of administration of law or other governmental functions. But you can also see in this that there are 12 sections of the obstruction law. And I want you to take notice of 5102 as well. As we go ahead and scroll down here to subsections definition of 5101, obstruction of administration of law or other governmental function. Let's take a look at the definition. A person commits a misdemeanor of the second degree if he intentionally obstructs impairs or prevents the administration of law or other governmental functions by force, violence, physical, I repeat, physical interference or obstacles, breach of official duty or any other unlawful act. So let me ask you Erie County fam, did you see Javier use force, violence, or physical interference or put any obstacles in the way of Justin Starvegi from across the street while just speaking using his First Amendment rights. Now that's dirty because the answer is no. But wait Erie County fam, Justin Starvegi gets even dirtier than that. Because let's go ahead and read section 5102, obstructing or impeding the administration of justice by picketing, etc. Now section 5102, subsection A, offense defined as a person is guilty of the misdemeanor of the second degree if he intentionally interferes with, obstructs or impedes the administration of justice or with the intent of influence any judge, juror, witness or court officer in the discharge of his duties, picketing or parading in or near any buildings houses or courts of the commonwealth 
or near a building or residence occupied by the use of such judge, juror, witness, or court officers, or which such intent to use any soundtracks or similar devices or resorts to any other demonstration in or near any such building or residence. Now as I pop up his charge on the screen, you can clearly see he was charged 5101. And you might ask, why am I making this a point? Let's go look at his charge paper. Clearly he was charged with section 5101, but what does it read down here in the description of the crime? On his charge papers, it reads, a person is guilty of a misdemeanor of the second degree if he intentionally interferes with, obstructs, or impedes the administration of justice or with the intent of influence in any judge, juror, witness, or court officer in the discharge of his duties. Now, why would dirty ass officer Justin Starvegi put section 50101 in the description of it, yet read 5102 definition in the charge papers? Let me tell you why, fam. Justin Starvegi knows that. Mr. Javier told him straight up, it is a physical interference, and he said it in the video, so he couldn't have this written on there, because there is video evidence of it, and he knows he did this man dirty, because he is a dirty, corrupt police officer. I ain't struggling. It's struggling as as physical. You know that? This man, you know, it's physical. (laughs) Yo, back away from me, man. I'm not instructing you, bro. I'm not instructing you, yo. It's you're physical. It's physical, dude. It's you physical. Keep out dude, it's me. physical. You can't you arrest keep, me. You, you can't arrest me, dude. That's a mess violation. You dude, keep I'm yelling out to me. Getting- That's right, Erie County fam. Justin Sarvaghi was put on notice by Javier that obstruction is a physical act. So when he went to put the definition, he had to change it for his motive so that hopefully the court system will screw this kid in the end. But let's go ahead and expose this tyrant. And just so you all remember, I personally, auditing Erie County, had an interaction with him where he unlawfully arrested me, but did not charge me when he found out I was on federal probation and would cause himself a federal investigation by charging me with a faulty charge and found out that I video recorded and he could not delete any of my footage because my camera was locked. Let's go ahead and recap how he treated me and the Erie County fam. The police department back here. pictures and that should have been it fam one of them activist guys this guy right here knew he told them three times what was going on but this police department couldn't help themselves the ego in this police department is out of hand it's what I can't hear you one of those activist guys Crime fight. Over here. Got some pretty slick ass bald tires down here. goods in this one. Get that screen turn pretty good. I'm gonna go get that off of this side though.
Whoa, wait a minute, Erie County fam. Is that a burner gun in the back of this police car? People would say, what's a burner gun? That's a gun that a police officer could just plant on somebody after they shot him and said, he's got a gun, he's got a gun. Now, I don't know what the procedure is of a gun in the back of a police car, but I do know they did not answer to my public records request about this gun, the serial number, who owns the gun, or the procedure of having a gun in the cop car. But I do know another thing, that there belongs to one and only Corporal Justin Starvage, our little red-headed, ego-tripping corporal we're about to run into. Just like that, I was out of here. I figured that was it. That was the end of it. Hey, what are you, what are you doing, man? Just taking some photographs out here in public. Huh? Just taking some photographs out in public. For what? It's not a public property. Like... This is not public property. But like, what are you, what are you taking photos for? Like inside of our cruises and stuff. Like, what's the purpose of that? Let's take some photographs. Anything I can see from public. That's just weird. No. This is very suspicious that you're taking photos of inside of our cruisers and stuff. Yeah. Wait a minute, Erie County fam. I had to pause it again to introduce you to the next tyrant of this film. This is Sergeant Sarah Scart. She is a major player in this film where she conspires against AEC's right to film in public by fabricating a crime with Justin here. In a moment, you'll see it all. Well, just taking a couple that's, photographs, that's all. That's just weird. Do I come take photos of your cars when I'm off duty? I don't know. Where do you work at? Oh, you're, you're exactly one of those guys, huh? What do you mean? One of those bait cars. Bait cars, huh? How you doing? This is an oldie, huh? You ever seen this before? Our cruisers. Well, do you live in the city? I don't answer questions. You, you don't live in the city, so if, it's not, if you don't live in the city, it's not your cruiser, right? You know? Pay taxes in the city. You pay taxes in the city, so you live sure here? Sure do. I bought a stick of gum on my way down here. Oh, boy. Yep, he's one of those. Can I, get, can I get a name and a badge number out of you? We're here. Just a badge number? That's all yeah, you guys got? That's all you're going to get. No names? Nope, because I'm not going to get your name, right? Can I get your name? Am I going to get your name? Am I going to get your is name? It my, is it my policy? Is it my policy? Is it my policy? You guys want to act like children out here. Can I get your name? I'm acting like a child. You're acting like a child, for I'm sure. I'm acting like a child. Can I get you're your name, sir? You're taking photos of all our Can prisoners. Your name? Uh, yeah, my name's Dan. Your name's Dan? That's correct. Dan what? Just Dan. Just Dan? I'm, I'm asking this man a question. You're interrupting. I, I gave you my first name. Can I get a name or a badge number out of you? It's a negative here, too, as well. Erie County fam, this is Officer Gary Peterson. Gary Peterson, when I first noticed him, he seemed to be quiet and just observe. And I thought, man, this guy looks dangerous. He's the type that just stares and then the last second he might pounce on you. But it turns out he's just a tyrant in training. He's only been with the police department for two months. Right, to ID. You got a name? And put us out with a man on the west lot. Can I talk? Can I say anything to you? Can I talk to you? Can I have a nice day. Sergeant PA. You don't got no name either?
Oh, yes, he does have a name, Erie County fam. And let me give that name to you. That's Sergeant Tom Lennox. Now, this interaction here puts two sergeants, one corporal, and two officers on the scene to conspire against AEC's rights using the color of law. Have a nice day. Apparently his name is Just Dan. Just Dan today, guys. You guys keep our cars pretty clean, I like that. All right, Erie County fam, this next part's gonna happen quick. It's gonna happen tricky. You're gonna see all these cops conspire together. You're gonna see the guy's body cam kick on here in a second. You're gonna see them do hand signals. They know what they're doing here. This is not the first time they've done this to somebody. That you can tell. Take a look. That. Hmm? Now that's not huh. uh, at Oh yeah, you created privacy. That's cool. Yeah. I like that. This guy's old, you huh? I don't see these old ones like this anymore. Yep. Are you want to go around? Got the old gong ball black and white. I like it. I'm live here. I'll tell you, Erie County fam, nothing says corruption quite like having to warn your fellow professionals, officers, that your camera is on. What's that? Let me see your fingers. I don't know why. No, thank you. What do you mean, no thank you? Oh. Door yeah. There's a whole ass hamper on the driver's side door handle. Listen. Buddy, don't fight. I'm not fighting. You guys are twisting my arm. Don't stop my recording. Don't stop my recording. I gotta be recording myself on this whole property. I never left this property. I'm still alive here. What do you mean, no thank you? And there it is, Erie County fam. That is their probable cause. I'm pretty sure it's going to be you. That is the RAS they use to lock AEC up here. Now, the Erie Police Department could use reasonable, articulable suspicion to lock anybody up at any time for anything. All they need to say is, you were near an area where they found a fingerprint, and now they can lock you up. This is a dangerous police department. Now let's talk about what happened once I got inside here. They denied the public records request for the security camera footage inside where they booked me, took my property, checked it in, ID'd me the whole nine yards of the arrest before putting me in a jail cell for another 45 minutes. They denied all the public records requests for any footage of the inside of this building or stuff like the rifle um, personnel records disciplinary records of the officers and the reason they gave is a section inside the public records request laws that says a record maintained by an agency in connection with the military homeland security national defense law enforcement or other public safety activities that if disclosed would 
reasonably likely to jeopardize or threaten public safety. Let's be honest, the reason they didn't want you to see what happened inside there is because they don't want you to see how two guys kneeled on my back to take the handcuffs off while the third person unhandcuffed it, threatening to beat the crap out of me if I moved. Um, those are the real reasons they don't want to release the information. And if that's an incorrect statement, Erie PA, please do release that jail cell footage so that people can see that you didn't kneel on my back to take the handcuffs off. Erie Police Station, please do explain to me how letting out the records of these officers, their disciplinary records, would affect public safety in any manner. So as we all can see, the Erie, Pennsylvania Police Department, City of Erie, definitely is full of corruption. And as long as they got Justin Starveggy as a corporal working there, there's going to be more corruption. So Javier is news is a brand new channel. As you can see here, he has 67 subscribers as of right now. Let's go ahead, Erie County fam, and get over there and subscribe so that this man can be on the, the scene. He is there in Pennsylvania. He is um, a resident in this area. He wants to open up his channel and expose these tyrants one more video at a time and with your help with your subscription you can get over there and join him and it's no joke over there in erie pennsylvania that is one corrupt police department and that justin is out of control it is the same one who put illegal handcuffs on me framed the whole incident and uh tore skin off my arms tore skin off a javier's arms already with handcuffs gets rough and doesn't mind being a YouTube star, but I'll tell you what, if they want the attention here at the Erie County fam, we're going to give it to them. You know, if they want to be on videos violating people's rights, we're going to publish them. We're going to expose it to the world, not only Erie County fam, but the whole world. So everybody get over there and help expose the Erie PA Police Department, City of Erie in the County of Erie in Pennsylvania. And just to give you guys an example of what you'll see on Javier's is news channel let me show you a few more clips of his work and how they are trying to do him dirty but as he asserts his rights and as a new channel he's learning let's get over there give him a little love and maybe even some constructive criticism so he knows how to assert his rights and support him in his endeavors to expose that tyranny because the Erie PA police department in my opinion is probably one of the worst I have ever seen you guys let me know what you know and think about it all in the comment section and get over there and subscribe. His link is in the description and you all tell him Mr. Erie County himself sent you and check out some of these other clips from his other videos. On your spotlight on. Huh? Let me see. Let me see your car number. That's what I need. I need your car number. Talk and feel. Talk and feel. Hey, man, you can't charge me with jaywalking anyways. Jaywalking is you can't charge me no more. You can't charge me no more for jaywalking. Okay. Knock it off, dude. Knock it off. Huh? What y'all gonna do? Arrest me? Y'all can't arrest me. Alright, y'all can't stop me. He's trying to turn he's he's turning when I'm walking. What's your name again? You know, y'all don't need to charge you my name. I didn't commit no crime. Okay? Get that right. No, Body cam on? It's all. I talked to you before. What's your name again? Oh, all right. You know I got a lawsuit in so I don't need to tell you, you my name. What's your first name? I don't need you to tell you my name. Okay. I don't have to tell you nothing, man. Did I commit a law? I, I commit a crime? I committed a crime? I committed a crime? I just saw him talking. Did I commit any crime? I don't know. Did you? Huh? Did, did I commit any crime? No, he was just talking. Okay, did I detain? Oh, did I detain? No, I didn't stop in the middle of the road. I stopped. Yeah, because he almost trying to hit me when I'm walking. He's turning at the same time when I'm walking over here. And it's on, it should be on the jazz camera. And I'm going to request that. Don't delete nothing. Because I'm going to request that. And we're going to figure it out. Okay? Your, your, your uh, body cam. You're on Ash Street. Yeah, live on Ash Street. Yeah, you sure? You're right. I'm the one that caught y'all with two, coming out with three guns out of the house. Illegally. And I got the. I got the oh, yeah. It is, Papa. I got the, I got the, incident, I got the incident number. You know that? I went to the police station. I got the incident number. Everything. I'm a great, I'm a great incident, man. I'm here for all my people. I work for the people. That's what I do. You know, you violate people's rights, man. You on YouTube too, man. You on YouTube too. Remember? You famous, violating people's rights. You know that? Yeah. You need all these officers here for this. Come on. 
I don't need to tell you when they. No? Well, nah. you're involving yourself in our. No, nah, not because I'm in, I'm in public. And a public sidewalk. I live right here. And I'm allowed to. I'm allowed to be. Where you, live? you live over here? I'm allowed to be in the sidewalk. I okay. know my rights. This is my First Amendment right to record y'all. And, uh. Freedom I'm of speech. Free is speech. Freedom of speech is your first yeah. amendment. Yeah. Right? And re record y'all, too. Okay. It's free to, it's free okay. to press. Well, if you know your rights, then that's It's free to press. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Uh, I already had this issue with the captain and all that stuff. I already okay, had good. talk with the mayor, too. What was the issue? And all that stuff. You know, for, about this going on, too. About what? About disorderly conduct. About y'all trying to charge people disorderly conduct. What's that? For recording y'all. Why would and, I charge you disorderly cussing, conduct? And cussing at y'all. Because it's, you were free, at it's us? A free to speech to cuss at y'all. It's free to speech to say any bad word in public. I'm in my public sidewalk. Well, that's fine. You, and I'm allowed to do believe, anything. What and what's your, what's your badge number? That's 499. What's your badge number? 1548. 1548? Okay. I think you're funny. Man. Hey, I'm not funny, man. Yeah, you're that's, funny. Why, that's, why we, that's why the public don't have a trust with y'all. And you want and you want the public to trust with y'all? You don't have to come up on me and ask me questions and tell me I'm involving myself. Dude, you're, you're following you talking about, me. You talking about I'm, I'm involved. I'm allowed. Away. I'm allowed. I'm, I'm allowed to walk. Hey, this is free. Me. This is a free country, man. I'm allowed to walk I'm the not, sidewalk. I'm not even saying anything. I'm allowed to walk the sidewalk, man. Okay. Well, guess what now I'm gonna follow. Now I'm gonna follow y'all because y'all doing something illegal now. Why don't you just stop talking? I'm allowed to talk, man. Free to speech. Okay. Get it right, man. Come on. You you hold an oath to that, man. You hold an oath to the Constitution, and you violated it right there. That's a federal lawsuit you can get. You know that? You can lose your car to file immunity, too. Yeah. Yep, show him, an idiot. Get your captain out here, too. That's right, Erie County fam. Get over there and subscribe to Javier's News. Give him support because these cops need exposing. We need somebody in this neighborhood, boots on the ground, and this is our man, the only one in PA in Erie pennsylvania that is on the ground let's get over there and support him and expose these lying tyrants oath-breaking pieces of trash now if they want to look good maybe they better start doing good because we got javier is news on the ground get over there and subscribe i'll see you guys in the comment section and we live in a society now where people want to recall how they discipline their child People that might get mad with this video is the people that probably already embarrassed their child. You can't you can discipline your child in their room. Take something away from them. If they act up, well, I'm like, son, you can't play the game. I ain't struggling. Instructing is as physical. You know that? This man, you know, it's physical. <laughs> Yo, back away from me, man. I'm not instructing you, bro. I'm not instructing you, yo. It's you physical. It's physical, dude. It's you physical. Out dude, it's me. physical. You can't you arrest can't, me. You, you can't arrest me, dude. That's my nice violation. It just comes natural for me. Dude, you pull the constitution out of your pockets out here. Like that was supposed to prove something. First Amendment. Freedom of the press. Right to Your name is not Dan Erie County. Um, this isn't Erie County. Yeah. Sure it is. I'm here is Dan Erie County. Legitimate? Maybe. Official? No.